Good evening. Wait, it's daylight. Good afternoon. We're going to talk about how to use smart switch on Samsung devices to back up the phone completely onto the SD card or, or and a little bit on the computer side as well. Backing up your phone onto the SD card or onto the computer on a regular basis is a very good idea. Not you. It is most advisable. It is easiest if you have an SD card because that way you can do a backup anytime, anywhere. And I will show you how. Also, it's helpful whenever you go from Android one number to the next number, like five to six, six to seven, seven to eight, Anytime you do that, even if you don't have any issues, it's a, it's a better idea, it's best practices, I should say, to do a factory reset of your phone because it's it just kind of helps smooth out all the kinks and get rid of potential problems. So, you'll go into settings, and then you will tap the search bar, and then type in smart switch. And if you don't see it this way, just go to the Play Store and search for smart switch and download it. It'll open up. And then you'll see in the upper right hand corner the three dots, tap those. Then you'll go to external storage transfer. If you have an SD card, it'll show up here. Then you can just hit the backup option. Then it'll calculate and show you all the things that it will back up. Including giving you options on how to back up or how far back to back up the text messages. 30 days, 3 months, 6 months, 12 months, 2 years, or all of them. Same thing with apps and app data. You can choose which ones that you want it to back up and back up the data or information of, I guess. And of course, media and documents. All these the things that are listed here are stuff that is not on the SD card. It will not create duplicates of contacts or apps or any media either. If you do not have an SD card, first I would, and, and if you can support one, or if your phone has a slot for it, I would recommend that you get one. But if you don't, and you don't want to spend the money on an SD card, you can always go to the link that I will put in the description to download the PC or Mac version of Smart Switch so you can back your phone up to your computer. Or if you want to do both, that's even better. Backups of your backups of your backups. And since I don't have, I haven't set up screen recording software on my computer, so you might have to find another video for the computer version. But really, once you download it and install it, it ha the prompts that it gives you will walk you through the process. However, I might put out an extended guide for the computer version because it's a little bit more complex when you want to choose what parts of the phone that you want to back up, but you still have that ability. I would recommend everybody do this on a monthly basis. Actually, I haven't done mine in... Oh yeah, yeah I did it for November. <laughs> We practice what we preach. I hope this was of some use to you and also stay beaming.